Hey what's going on guys it's Alec here and some of you guys requested me to make this thumbnail video so I thought what the hell I'll make it. So basically I'm going to show you how to make a basic thumbnail today. So what you want to do you want to go to file, no and you want to have your size is at 1280 by 720 and yeah just click ok and then it's going to come with this white page thing you want to go layer, layer from background and just click OK and um, we don't want to just keep it white so we want to select two colours I'm going to have a light blue and a lighter blue and I want to click this granite tool over here and literally click and drag down near the centre and then what we want to do we want to go to flitter distort and we want to go to wave and make a nice pretty wave so we want to have this set at 300 at the top and 50-50 here at the below the top and that should just make all this kind of liney pattern thing there you go and then you've got both your colors in lines and we want to go to fl flitter again and then we want to go to start and we want to go to polar coordinates and then click OK and then you get this kind of eye illusion yeah, thing we don't just want that, we're going to have some text in, I'm going to have my text size 150. So I want to go, I'm going to reposition this a bit and then I want to go to blending options and I'm going to add a stroke and a colour overlay and I'm going to have that white. And also I'm going to add a glow. To it just so it looks a bit more that the text stands out a bit more and everything and just I'm just gonna have that spread 31% and size 65 so to file and then open and get this little face thing here to have in this thumbnail you're just gonna want to go to the top there and click and press move to new window so now I've got this here, we want to use the pointer tool just to, or arrow tool just to drag it over into the composition. Right, so it's a bit big at the minute, so what you want to do to make it small, smaller, you're going to want to go to edit and then free transform, or you could just press ctrl T. I'm going to move this around a bit and just apply that and there's quite a bit of free space still left so I'm going to go to the text tool and add a bit more text I'm just going to write out by TCSJ and have it like in a handwriting kind of text now I'm just going to move this text a bit a bit so I can have it in a nice position I'm going to go to blending options and then I'm going to add a colour overlay on it, not a stroke. And there you go, so it's got this kind of handwriting effect. So it looks a bit messy at the minute, so I'm going to move it all around a bit. So let's move that up there and move that down a bit and this down a bit. pretty much got your thumbnail there you can add other things to it as well I've just showed you the basics today so what you want to do to save it you want to just go to file and then save as and you either save it as a JPEG or a PNG file both do pretty much the same I think and then I'll just save it as loads of random letters and just press OK Thanks for watching guys. If you want me to do any more tutorials or want to request any, just comment below. And I'll see you next time.